So in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how I achieved this beautiful gilly head wrap. So first of all, you're going to take your head wrap. You can use a scarf also, but um, I prefer gilly so that the design stands well. You can see I'm using the short part of that gilly. I'm not using a very big gilly. And I'm just going to take a small part and fold it or scrunch it. Just scrunch like 10% of the gilly. You can do it that way. Or if you want to make it neater, you can hold it a little then with your two hands. Then start trying to create something like a pleat. So you do it equally. Yes, then you want to secure it. I suggest to use a rubber band. You can also use, you can just tack it also a little with needle and thread. But rubber band too will also do the trick. So tack it with rubber band and make sure it is secured tight. In the, with this rubber band, I went in three times. So I tied it the first time, the second time, and the third time so that it is very, very well secured because of the style we're going to do. And this style is, the amazing thing is this style is something you can achieve by yourself on your own. You do not need like a gilly artist or the help of anyone. So when you are going for that one bear occasion and you want your gilly to stand out, this is what you should try so you can see i'm trying I'm, I'm i'm securing it with the rubber band you can see the pleats formed you can see because of the way i did it the pleats formed now from the um longer part that's the 90 percent of the gilly you are going to use it to wrap your head you may want to fold the sides so the rough um the edges of the gilly don't show you can see the way i'm i'm wrapping it I'm not using the the, the um, longer side. I'm wrapping it all the way from the short side. You can see how I am putting it on my head. You want to, of course, try this gilly. Until you get it, you keep watching, you try, keep watching, you try. If you have any question, please leave it in the comments. So now, I am going to hold it, secure it by the back of my head. And I'm going to start twisting. So if you are doing this style, I suggest that probably you um, iron that on low cut or your corn roll so that um, you'll be able to secure it very well. So you can see now I'm twisting and twisting and twisting and twisting up to a tangible point. Ensure you twist it up. Ensure the back is held tight with the twisting because you don't you don't want this to lose. You don't want your gilly to lose. Okay. So now I'm going to start from behind that um, place, this 10% portion that I use rubber band to tie from behind. I'm going to begin going around it with the twisting. You can see it. As I'm going around, I keep twisting. As I'm going around, I keep twisting. I keep twisting until my gilly is exhausted. So um, don't go for an extra, extra long gilly, okay? So you don't over twist and twist and twist. So you can see I twist until my gilly is, um, my the long part of my gilly is exhausted. You can either pin it, you can, you can stuff it under. You can see I stuffed it under. You can stuff it under and pin it or you can just stuff it under and it will stay if you actually did it a, a, a very tight way but you can see i'm using pin to secure it because of course better safe than sorry you don't want your gilly to fall down while you are dancing but i can assure you that as this gilly is on my head it is already very secure now for this 10% that we have picked out, you can see it. You can see the pleats have formed into something like a fan that has fallen out on two sides. So you can see I have moved the gele up to my hairline. And now I am going to start creating the beautiful um, design. 
so i'm folding it backwards because of the excesses because of course it is too full so i bent it and i folded it backwards just to bring out that beauty and bring out the design we want so now i'm pinning you want to pin of course from the closer end pin it closer end to um the thing that you rounded do not spread it far so that this um fan design shows and is very very obvious now you want to arrange your gilly can arrange it as it suits you so your gilly will stand and by the time people see your gilly they'll be like wow who did this gilly also do well to secure the back any place that seems like there's a loose place secure it so here's the final look i hope you found this video helpful if you did do well to give this video a like do well to comment and do not forget to subscribe stay tuned for more bye